All right, welcome back to KSN News at Noon. Kiana Lucero and Kaylee Eberhardt from Tanganyika Wildlife Park are here with us today. It's good to have you both in today and, and tell us what you brought in with you. Yeah, we brought a couple tortoises today. This is Doug, he is a leopard tortoise. And on the ground down here, we have lightning speeding around. He is a radiated <laughs> tortoise. Okay, so uh, what are the differences between these two? Yeah, so Besides if you look- the, Obviously the shells. <laughs> yeah, that's the main difference is gonna be their shells. Doug has more of a spotted pattern, so hence the name leopard tortoise, kind of that spotty pattern. And our radiated tortoise lightning gets his name because of those kind of sunbursts that kind of radiate oh, okay. from the center of each little pattern there and give him that cool pattern. And he's a burner. He is fast. <laughs> he too, is. Right? That's why we decided lightning was a good name for him. He likes to cruise around. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How do these two spend their days? Um, so Doug has an exhibit. You guys can see him out at the park. He's over by our children's zoo area, usually cruising around. He also can get pretty speedy. Um, Lightning actually lives, lives in a behind the scenes area of the park, but this month we're doing a monthly exclusive with our tortoises. So you can go behind the scenes and meet some of our radiated tortoises, our Aldabra tortoises. We have Sulcata tortoises. Um, so you get to meet all of the different species we have. Okay. And, and are they similar? And, 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 and how, you know, what they eat and things like that? Yeah, they're mostly going to eat types of plant material. Um, this guy's going to get a little bit bigger. He is actually the fourth type of, fourth largest type of tortoise in the world. Oh. Um, and he's going to live a little bit longer, probably close to like 75, maybe even up to 100 years if he's lucky. How old is um, he now? We don't know. Both of them were donated to us, okay. so we don't know their exact ages. Um, and then our radiated tortoise down here is only going to get to be about 50 years or so and about 50 pounds. Okay. Yeah, Doug. Doug, Doug is cool. <laughs> he wants to cruise. Yeah, Doug wants to get down on the floor. <laughs> well, tell us about the, you got any events coming up at the at the at Tanganyika here soon? We do. So this month, our exclusives are the tortoise experience and our fox experience. So the foxes that we brought last month, um, they have an experience this month. And then next month in October is our big pumpkins at the park um, event that we do. So it's every Saturday in October um, from 6 to 10 p.m. And then this year, we're actually doing something new. We are doing an adults only night on the 20th of October. It's a Friday, so that should be pretty fun. Okay, that does sound like a good time. Go hang, hang out with the tortoises. <laughs> All right, Kiana and Kaylee, thank you so much for joining us today with the tortoises here on KSN News at noon, and we will be right back.